my profound greetings to all members of asisc the pandemic and the lockdown declared in february march caught us totally unawares and we had to quickly adjust to the new normal of the online and the digital mode the first thing that we had to do was to identify a suitable digital platform and uh, we honed on to google classrooms zoom microsoft teams cisco webex a couple of more and then finally uh, decided to use the microsoft teams however the biggest challenge was that ours as you know is a century or more than a century old establishment and uh, we are slightly digitally not so up to the mark as uh, probably some of these newer schools which are there mostly in the metros and even otherwise and our faculty is also more hands on and less digital because we have a large campus and we believe in a lot of physical activities and physical extracurricular activities so it was a very big challenge to orient ourselves from that mode to the now virtual mode where our campus where our large grounds large buildings uh, were uh, inconsequential so to say and it's only the quality of teachers and the quality of teaching learning that mattered teachers sacrificed their summer vacations and work trained very diligently that during the months of uh, march april till about 20th of may to become experts at this particular game of online teaching 20th may onwards we started engaging the parents and connecting them uh, by sending them links in all of the teams and dot on 1st june we started our online classes in between this uh, period we somehow managed to distribute the study material and it was a big challenge because we have borders and day borders both so uh, it was a big challenge to have the study material reach the concerned household our personal experience around microsoft teams has been very good and uh, we have successfully uh, uh, have the assignments sent to the students their corrections their evaluations their uh, tests now the half yearly examinations are going on its security features uh, its connectivity its clarity its versatility its use of uh, microsoft apps like ms word and things like that so one can one is generally quite satisfied with it uh, it also has a very good system of the student students digital attendance it was quite satisfactory for the senior school junior school was more of a challenge which we will be covering separately not understanding all that i have spoken i would still like to say that one is missing the students terribly and we are waiting for the normal schools to open up so that we can uh, get to interact uh, with the children but after the normal schools open i am quite convinced that now we will be moving on to hybrid teaching in which uh, uh, there will be a combination of both online and offline classes and this has been a very good experience this crisis has actually turned into an opportunity where both the students and the faculty members have got oriented and acquainted to the latest digital technology which as the pundits say is the future of the world one thing that the pandemic has taught us is that the human spirit is indomitable our students teachers and more importantly the parents have admirably risen to this challenge their coordination has resulted in the students participating in webinars competitions 
as well as online examinations all these things shall stand them in good stead newsletters have been taken out which showcase the talents of our children and we are on the verge of going ahead with a very historic event for the very first time we are about to go ahead with the virtual prize giving function to felicitate our students our winners i believe that the school had set out to imbibe the lessons of empathy and gratitude in the students and we have succeeded to a large extent in our endeavor today we are facing something very different and something very new none of us actually envisage this but then again we have to deal with it in fact our teachers are the ones who have actually had the uh, most difficult time learning this new system of technology and some of our teachers they are actually on the verge of retirement and they have yet learned this and my section is the junior section so you can think how difficult it is from right from the nursery class 3 three year old child they are all the teachers are dealing with these students and engaging them in such a manner that these children are actually keen to come to these classes we have to have the teachers in fact have had to have to develop the uh, ppts like they say in a very animated interactive manners then again if we talk about the interaction apart from the interaction that has been going on with the students by asking them to switch on their cameras the teachers interacting with them we have also in our school we've had online if you say elocutions fancy dress storytelling competitions the children have actually thoroughly enjoyed all this apart from that the concept is old of a newsletter or something but we did bring in a e newsletter which is again highly motivating to the children as we can print much more than we would have otherwise done so there again the teachers and the parents the cooperation we have got with the, from the parents i would definitely say it has been commendable we have had no problem as far as the parents go students go they have been highly appreciative of the classes they have been interacting continuously with the teachers and in whatever manner possible we have been helping them out and no problem so far uh at this point of time i would like to add that uh, with the sports and all having shut down we did start some yoga classes early in the mornings and we got a very positive response for that initially the teachers they introduce the regular sports and all they talk about the sports and then they go into yoga which is something that the students can do at home and it is naturally yoga i don't need to say anything about that it is healthy for everyone be it a 3 year old or be it an adult and for that matter i have had a lot of feedback that the parents have also been actually doing yoga with the students so i would say uh, we were able to take up this challenge and the teachers of rajkumar college raipur have done a commendable job and we have had a lot of support from the parents thank you